Story time about how I found out my husband was hooking up with men off of Craigslist. Disclaimer, this is not my story time. I sent me on Instagram. My husband and I have been married for five years. This man is the most prudish person I have ever met in my entire life. He never curses. He does not drink. Basically, he's never done anything naughty in his life. When we met, he was the perfect candidate for me. My parents are very religious and very strict. When they saw the way my husband was, basically super uptight, never wanting to do anything fun, they insisted that I marry him. So basically, this is all my parents' fault. To be honest with you guys, I never really was super attracted to him. But I knew that he would be a good provider. He's pretty high up in the company he works for and he makes north of $300,000 per year. But I do own two of my own businesses so it's not like I need him to survive. But my parents insisted on me marrying somebody who was already well off. And of course one of my dreams is to become a mother so I need a man who's going to be able to provide for me and my kids especially when I'm pregnant. So we ended up getting married. Was there passion in chemistry? Not so much. But we did have a good time and he would make me laugh. We essentially became really good friends. Up until I found some stuff on his laptop. Part two is up. Part two of how I found out my husband was hooking up with men off of Craigslist. Disclaimer is not my story time. It's done me on Instagram. One day while I was working from home, I needed to get on his laptop to check our cameras. I just got a new set of security cameras for our house. I needed to make sure that they were all working. I opened his laptop, typed in the password, and it was wrong. It always had the same password for the past five years. I didn't bother texting him. Instead, I tried to guess. And because I know this man so well, I guessed it in the first try. But as soon as I log in, there's about five Craigslist windows open all with similar titles male looking for male male interested in male company this literally shook me to my core You're telling me that i'm married to a gay man and that he's hooking up with men off of craigslist that's when i went ahead and checked his email only to find that he had been sending pictures and other things to these men not only that but he had met with two of them i instantly printed out all the evidence like i said in part one i'm not particularly attracted to my husband i never have been i really only married him because my parents pressured me into it here's what i did instead of just asking for a divorce I wanted to humiliate him I needed to make him pay. After printing everything out, I sent it to his job. And I sent it to his parents and my parents. Part three is up. That's when I sent videos of my own husband hooking up with other men to his job, my parents, and his parents. At this point, I had been married to a man that I wasn't attracted to for five years, only to find out that he was hooking up with other men. Off of Craigslist. Remember I said in part one how prudish my husband was? He always made himself seem like he was the perfect man. Like he had never done anything bad in his life. But let me tell you, some of the things I read in those emails, and the pictures, and the video? Disgusting. No wonder he put off having kids for so long and no wonder he made me get on the pill because he never had the intention of having kids when everyone received their packages my husband called me super upset he said that he had only done it for about a week and that it was just him experimenting and he told me that his job put him on suspension my parents of course stopped speaking to him mother-in-law calls me on the phone and tells me that she had always known that he was gay and apparently they insisted on him not marrying me but he was set on having the perfect wife the perfect life we're obviously getting a divorce now and i'm getting all his money or at least i'm gonna try he's already claiming that i'm obsessed with him so he wants to get a restraining order I need to make him suffer even more. How should I do this? Part 4 will be up soon.